remember who you are. That was me doing the James Earl Jones impression. <laughs> What's up, everybody? I'm Sly the Movie Guy, and the live-action Lion King trailer had dropped. Oh, my goodness. I have lost my mind when this thing dropped on TV. I couldn't believe it. It was... I've been waiting for this teaser trailer since everybody online was talking about it. They saw it at D23. They said it looks amazing. I was so... I was like, man... When I'm going to get to see this, because The Lion King is one of my favorite Disney classic films. I was so hyped up about the movie. I was, because one man, because John Favreau directed The Jungle Book, and that looked good. The CGI of Baloo, Shere Khan, and all the animals, all that looked good. And when they announced that a live action Lion King was coming, I was like, why well, would y'all do it? But when they said John Favreau's doing it, I was so excited. So... Anyways, let's see what the trailer is. And I left the link down of the trailer down below in the description box. Basically, from the trailer, what we get is where the sun rises. And that looks like from the old classic of the Lion King. And we get to see the CGI animals. And it looks really real. It looks realistic. I don't even know they're CGI, but the animals look really good. And then a little bit is probably see birds flying, whatever. And James Earl Jones' voice, because he's voicing Mufasa, and that looks really, really good. And the voice, just hearing his voice is like heaven. And we get to hear his voice, and then we get to hear, we get to see the, excuse me, we get to see the stampede, which looks really good. Everything just looks good. And then after that, we get to hear the circle of life, the I might have said the wrong words, but... <laughs> But we get to see Rafiki rubbing the stuff on Simba's head. Rafiki, the baboon, the, the man, mandrel, excuse me. It looks good. That holding up Simba. Simba looks, the cub looks really cute. I'm losing words. But everything, it just, it looks really, really good. John Favreau and them did a phenomenal, looks like they did a phenomenal job of this. The animals looks freaking awesome. In the case you didn't know who's voicing the people, Basically, you can look online. Basically, I'll I'll leave down who's voicing the casting down below in the description box. But basically, Seth Rogen's voice in Pumbaa, which I think that really could work because Seth Rogen, I found him funny on a couple of films like Neighbors and stuff. So I think that was kind of a neat cast. And Billy Eigner as Timon and John Oliver as Zazu and the adult Simba. Basically, is going to, is the voice going to be that is Donald Glover, Beyonce, Nala, which I think she'll do a fine job. I don't know. We'll see. James Earl Jones as Mufasa. That I was like, I was so excited. When I heard that earlier, I think in 2017, I like, you finally bring back that one. One of my wanted back was Jeremy Irons as Scar, which we don't see in the trailer. But basically, the person that's going to voice Scar is Choato Ejio Ford. Which I think he'll do. I think he'll do great. I don't think it's. I don't know. It might. I don't know if it's going to surpass Jeremy Irons. That's a quick. But I don't think it. We don't. I don't think. Don't try to do a Jeremy Irons impersonation. Which I know he's not going to do that. But I like to see his interpretation of Scar. I'm pretty sure it's going to be good. I ain't going to compare it by Jeremy Irons because Jeremy Irons did a phenomenal job. So let's see what Cho to Edgeo Four do. Basically, Alpha Word is going to voice Sarabi. And that's basically it. Well, I forgot the other one. Rafiki's gonna be voiced by the father that did the Black Panther, the black, the father of Black Panther. I forgot the guy's name. I think uh, John Connie. Yeah, John Connie. That's who it is. He's going to voice Rafiki. So the casting, I can't wait for. So I really can't wait for this. The trailer really looks good. If y'all haven't seen it yet, really look look at the trailer. It looks really gorgeous. I. I can't wait for this movie because Lion King is one of my childhood movies growing up. I love this movie dearly, and I can't wait to see what John Favreau does with this movie. If he tweaks something up, it's something because, like I said, if you're doing a remake, do something a little bit different. I'm, and, but the Lion King is so perfect, so what could be different from this movie? Basically, from what the reports are that I heard in the previous in the last couple of months that. Basically, the one the song's going to be out, Be Prepared. So, I'm kind of curious how the live action Lion King's going to do it. 
I think that's kind of good. You don't want to keep doing, you don't want to do the same stuff like that. So pretty much the other song is going to be in there. Can You Feel the Love Tonight, Akuna Matata, and Can't Wait to Be King. So pretty much all those are in there. I'm just, I'm just excited. I'm just saying everything and I'm just so excited looking at this trailer. It looks really good. Anyways, guys, let me know in the comment section down below. What do you think about the trailer? Do, it, do you like it or not? I'm pretty sure you're going to be amazed and booze your mind like I am today. Let me know in the comment section what you think about the trailer. Anyways, guys, if you like this video, click thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, click subscribe and the bell button. I'd like to see you next time on Slide the Movie Guy. Peace.